and Liverpool's David Price. So welcome them up to the stage, please. Here's David. You come here, David. Nice to see you again. And here's Christian. Thanks, Christian. You can take, you can take a seat there. You'd like to translate? No problem at all. Quite understand. Well, I said it to, uh, to Lennox Lewis earlier, but Joseph Parker and the WBO champion is a potential who, for whoever wins this. So that's a massive incentive, isn't it? Yeah, it makes sense. But uh, all of the champions make sense after the fight of Christian win. And how confident is he? I mean, these two have fought before, haven't they? A few years ago when they were amateurs, but they have fought before. Yeah, I feel very confident because he won't um, um, give him the return for the Olympic Games or for the amateur time. Boxers never forget a defeat, do they? Particularly not against somebody in particular. Yeah, that's it. That's it. Okay, right, David, tell us, tell us your... So it was, a, it was a, a qualifier, effectively, for the Beijing Olympics, wasn't it? It was, yeah. It was whoever won the, the fight between myself and Christian back in 2008 would, would go to the Beijing Olympics. Thankfully, I won that time. Uh, obviously, went to the Olympics, but a long time ago, many things have changed. And, Saturday night's going to be an exciting fight for the fans. You know, we're, we're, we're both fighters who can who come to attack really, and we're both going to be on the offensive. We both know we can hurt each other, but I'm going to be going out there to do damage. You know, the, it's not time for playing around anymore in this game as far as I'm concerned. I'm at, I'm at a point in my career where if I win this fight, it's going to open doors to many big fights. And the same for Christian Amor, which, which makes it a fascinating fight. It's a, it's a 50-50 fight. It's going to, you're going to see a great heavyweight fight on, on Saturday night, and uh, it's one I'm looking forward to getting stuck into. Do you see the route through to Joseph Park and the WBO title if you were to win? Yeah, possibly. I mean, that, that's something that, that could happen. And, and like Christian's man there has just said, any of, the, any of the champions, you know, but that, that's the thing that this fight can do. It's going to open doors on all levels, obviously, if, it, if, it's, if it's the WBO European title. That, that's the, the easiest route to go. Um, but obviously, the obstacle in front of me needs to be dealt with first on Saturday night, and that's what I intend to do. Are you a slightly different fighter than you were, say, 18 months ago? Oh, yeah, I'd, I'd have to say I'm slightly different. Um, you know, uh, if it wasn't, I don't think I'd be here now. Um, you know, I, I do believe I've come on in the last couple of years and things have changed a little bit and people will see the best of me on Saturday night. But that, that's what I'm saying. This game is dog eat dog. You know, we, we can be friends after the fight, myself and Christian, but before now, before it and going into it on Saturday night, going in there to do damage because that man's standing in my way of, of potentially bigger payday, bigger opportunities and, and me, me future early. So, you know, we'll, We've got to go in there, all, all guns blazing. And in what ways uh, are you different? Are you are you're heavier? You're more proactive? You're more aggressive in the ring? Then, then three, yeah. You know, um, th there's not much more to say. Bigger, stronger, and better. Brilliant. Thank you very much indeed, Christian and Dave. We'll get some photographs.